Hi guys, it's ASBYT and today we're talking about OnePlus and the possible launch of a brand new folding smartphone. It's been dubbed as the first in a new series, an even smoother, faster and more burdenless experience and a vision of both new technology and alternate design approach for the future of smartphones. So without further ado, let's find out what on earth is going on here. Let's get straight to it. Right, so we've seen the likes of the Samsung Galaxy Fold, for example, the Huawei Mate X, the Royal Flex Pi, and even sort of products like this dual screen display phone from LG. Not even had a chance to review this yet. It's been that crazy busy, but they were all part of the sort of first wave of folding smartphones. But are OnePlus readying themselves for a foldable device of their own, ready to launch in concept form at CES 2020? Now, if you are a big fan of OnePlus, and drop a like on this video if you are, if you are a big fan, you will know that I think it's their sixth year anniversary that's coming up. And to honor this achievement, they will be launching a brand new concept device at CES 2020 in Las Vegas on January the 7th. Now, according to many, this will be the first in a long list of concept devices that they will be launching in a series, giving them the opportunity to raise brand awareness further, create hype, and most importantly, experiment with new technologies that could then be used in future flagships. It's a method used by quite a lot of other brands such as Vivo and Xiaomi, like with the Mi Mix Alpha. So the key line in all of these cryptic messages for me is the part where they say alternative design approach for the future of smartphones. Now for me, this has to mean a new form factor and presumably in my head, one of four possible options. Number one is a front camera under the display, which would enhance the consumer experience. It's a technology that OnePlus's sister brand Oppo have been playing around with, but I don't really see this as a radical enough form factor change to necessarily class it as an alternative design approach. The second possibility is that they could be going portless. We hear the next iPhone could be going in this direction, and there have been many Android phone manufacturers that have been toying with the idea. Vivo with the Next 3 is basically buttonless, and Huawei did a very similar thing with the Mate 30 Pro, other than the power button, due to that waterfall display. And apparently even Samsung with the Galaxy Note 10 were thinking about possibly going portless and buttonless, but after testing, they decided the technology wasn't ready. So this is definitely a possibility, but it's not my favorite pick right now. The final two possibilities are probably the more obvious and believable to again fit round the cryptic messages we've heard. And they are the fact that OnePlus could be designing a concept phone similar to Xiaomi with the Mi Mix Alpha, a wraparound phone with almost screen on all sides, or a folding smartphone. I'm personally hoping for the latter, as I don't currently get the wraparound design in terms of usability. I'm not sure what it adds to the consumer, and the thought of how easy those type of devices might be to damage is giving me heart palpitations right now. We've got to be a little bit skeptical because of course, Pete Lau, the CEO, said back in October at the 7T and 7T Pro launch that the technology and ability to have foldable screens are not very mature yet but that might be why they've chosen to go down the concept route so that they can test the technology before bringing it to mass market. And as well, in three months, a lot can change in the tech world, as you know. What we do know is that traditionally, the OnePlus motto is to provide affordable or at least semi-affordable products that focus on speed and efficiency of use. So if they could deliver this multi-purpose device, maintaining this mindset, make it thinner and make the front display larger than on the Galaxy Fold, for example, and at a better price point than the offerings already available, we could be on to a winner. So right now, the next device from OnePlus is a bit of a mystery, but one thing's for sure, I am incredibly excited. And if you are too, let me know in the comment section below and let me know what you think this mystery concept device is from OnePlus in Las Vegas, California. It's not even California, why have I said that? Get your geography right, or is it California? Nevada, of course it is. What am I talking about? Shush, get back to your drizzly rain in the UK and just, you know, 
like and share if you enjoyed this content, subscribe and hit that notification bell if you're new to the channel and want to be notified every time I post a video on anything tech, news, unboxings, reviews. I love you and leave you. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers, boys. See you